So for today, we're going to be looking at seasonal challenges for week 10. There is not a lot, so this video might be super fast. Uh, if you guys like the video, like, comment, and subscribe. I really do these just to help people out so that way they can know what's up. But if you guys like the video, again, commenting, subscribing really does help because a huge portion of people are not subscribed. But again, let's just get into the video. So for the first one, we're looking at Haunting C Cacophony. Uh, defeat combatants with machine gun final blows on the derelict Leviathan and defeat powerful scorn in any Sivir activity. Uh, this is not too hard. Uh, machine gun kills. Just use the new <laughs> the new one from the season, and then powerful score and just go into any sever, sever activity and just do it. It's not that hard. Uh, for the for the other one, Europe Europa activities on Europa earn progress by completing bounties, patrols, public events, and lost sectors. I would most likely just be doing lost sectors a lot, and then maybe some bounties on the side. I would ignore patrols and public events because those take too long. But yeah, lost sectors, I'd just be doing doing it over and over and over. For the next one is Vanguard Ornament. Acquire the Vanguard Ornament for Chain of Command. And that's pretty much it. This one's not too hard. It just kill, like just turn your brain off and do some Vanguard stuff. I unfortunately have to do a bunch of Vanguard stuff because I hate Vanguard. I think it's the worst playlist in the game. Uh, and yes, I do I do include that over Gambit and Crucible. I think Gambit is way more fun than Vanguard and Crucible is way more fun than Vanguard. Vanguard's terrible. Uh, but yeah, you can do Vanguard Ops and just turn your brain off and just... I'm thankfully a legend, but that's also terrible because I have to go through it again because you have to get to level 16 if I remember correctly, which is either legendary or, or which is legend or myth, mythic three. I don't remember, but still terrible. I hate it, but yeah, you can do Vanguard ops. You can do nightfalls, uh, GMs. I don't know if they're worth it, but yeah, that's pretty much it for Eververse this week. We are looking at the pomegranate gloss, which is an interesting color. Not gonna lie. I like the red. I like the, the color of this red. I really do. I'm not the biggest fan of this yellow, but overall, I, I would actually pick this up if you don't have it. Um, for the transmit effect, it's a castle. I'm not going to look at it. It's a ship. Final instar, which looks boring. It looks kind of like a cicada. Not going to lie. Uh, Tropical casual, which whatever. For the other stuff, we have gray nitrite, which is one of my favorite looks for the what the fuck is this gun called the uh, surrealist regime definitely one of my favorites i actually use this one a lot uh the all right dawn ship which is i think this is from either this it's this year it has no it's it's from last year i think uh the micro mini if you don't have this one is definitely one of the coolest ones in the game uh aside from the new go go kart one which i do like the predator sun shell which Looks like whatever's to be quite honest. We have teamwork dance and then we have flag on the on the play. So for shaders, we have golden age wine, which it's a good purple. I'm not a fan of yellow and purple, but it's it's not bad. Uh, we have welded brass, which is a pretty cool blue and black. Although this more looks this more looks like a black brown or brown black. Well, either way, looks pretty cool. We have oiled algae, definitely one of my favorite uh, shaders, and the other one, which is the vintage timber. These two are really good. I highly recommend vin vintage timber. If you don't want to get the other one, vintage timber is definitely a must. It's a really good, good black and gold, and the oiled algae is a good white and gold. So that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. This one was a fast one, but again, like I said, uh, week 10 just surprises me a little. I'm not gonna lie. I was expecting a little bit more than this But this should be the last week as in next week. We're not getting a week 11. So If you guys are like me and don't, still have like a lot left I think I have like I don't know math right now, but yeah, I have I have a few left and some of these I'm just like I don't want to do this like at all This if I don't complete it this season, this is gonna be like the third time the third time in a seat or the third yeah the third season that i haven't gotten the the uh the large bright dust pile which i if i remember correctly it's three thousand or six thousand but i fucking doubt it sticks at six thousand but yeah let me know what you guys think in the comments below uh let me know what you guys think yeah honestly this was pretty surprising okay so what is it? It's arms. Okay. So if you don't have any exotic arms, then excavation site, what is that? 12, I think it is. Uh, 
is going to be your best bet in Firebase Hades on the EDZ. Definitely not a hard one, but it would be annoying. So just be just be prepared. But yeah, be safe and I'll see you guys later.